bad idea. It's a horrible idea. Because? Be well, in January, I mean, it's great in the summer months. We get later sunsets, mm -hmm. and the, the sunrise is still at a reasonable hour. In January, though, the sun's not coming up until after 9 a.m. But it really depends on where you live, right? Yes, and that, that's, the, you that's, know, that's the other the part. Issue. You know, New York, it's over an hour uh, earlier. Before, yeah, earlier that the sun's coming up, too. Right. So, But it, doing it here, doing away with you know, falling back would mean kids standing at the bus stop in the dark. Yeah, you think in January it's dark. At 8 a.m. it's still pitch black out, and then the, it's colder longer, so you have, you know, temperatures that take longer to rise, too. So you have Icier conditions. Icier roads, yeah. more people on the roads in January. So Things to think about. I voiced my, I voiced my opinion. <laughs> there it is. Oh, I forgot I had a graphic. I had to keep going. <laughs> These are the sunrise times. Yes, okay, so if we kept daylight saving time all year, this is what we have now, June, okay? So the sun rises just before 6, sets after 9 o'clock. That's with daylight saving time now, but the summer's fine, but then see in January, 9.01, that's the sunrise time and the sunset time. That's more reasonable. It's 6.10, but uh, it's that sunrise. I think that's, that'd be the biggest factor. All right, this